All right, this is a quick video on my opinion on chisel ground knobs. And I'm starting this off by saying that most of, most chisel ground knives you see are actually made for 10% of the human population. Left-handed people. Most chisel ground knives are not made to work properly for right-handed people. Got here is chisel that's a small chisel. I think I actually bought this. I was um, glass bedding a rifle stock and I needed a small chisel to help clean out uh, some of the uh, areas in the stock um, for the glass bedding. Um, but anyway, it's a chisel. Chisel ground. It's really sharpened on one side. Just like a you know chisel ground knife. Now, chisel you know, not to insult anybody, but the way a chisel's made, the angle bevel is up, not down, and the chisel digs down into the wood, and with the bevel, allows the wood to come up and the chisel to go down. Just like using a plane. If this was set into a plane, it would be the same concept. Except you would set your, your depth on your plane and you would go. Now, will this cut the other way if I flip it over? It will, but see, it wants to stop. It doesn't really, as it doesn't glide the way it's made, all right. It's it's not made. To, you have to you have to really flip the angle up and dig down into the wood instead of easily going down, all right. So as a chisel is made, the flat of the chisel goes against the the cutting median and your pressure. You know, cuts what you're going to cut. Now, saying that, I don't have a lot of chisel ground knives because I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of them. Never have been. But I've got a couple examples. This is a uh, Milkner Adams from Booker chisel ground. I got this for I, I run um, as like a little backup knife when I run. Now this has got a very um, steep grind but it's a chisel ground knife and this is actually ground correctly for a right-handed person you see the the grind is on the right hand side of the blade so as a right-handed person I get ready to cut just like a chisel the flat is against the cutting surface with the the grind side up where it can cut into the wood. So that is actually how this should look for a right-handed person. Left-handed person, use this. Now you got the flat on top, the grind on bottom. I still can cut, but I have to really go deep into my angle to bite into the wood. See, now I'm like really cutting down to bite. But if it's ground correctly for a right-handed person, I don't have to go deep. Now this isn't made for like you know really cutting. This like say, I can. You know it's more of a, a backup tool. All right. But you see, right-handed, I can easily cut. Left-handed, I have to find the bite of the blade, which I really have to come up. Which, you know, I'm not using this blade as, as effective as it should be. So this one's actually made correctly. Now one thing I've noticed, 10% of the people are left-handed. So that makes, again, 90% of us right-handed. You pick up a knife and look at it. You're going to buy a knife. You tend to hold it with the left-hand side of the blade up. That's what you're looking at when you pick a knife up and look at it if you're a right-handed person. You normally don't pick the knife up with the 
blade out unless you're, you know, bushcrafting and you're doing a chest lever type uh, cut. So when you pick a knife up and look at it, you're looking typically at the left hand side of the blade. All right, we call that the pretty side of the blade. That's the the side of the blade that you know the knife makers are selling you. So you pick it up, and I can't see the you know the chisel, the, the you know the grind of this blade. I just see a flat portion. The more attractive side, the side that the grind's on, is the left handed side. So if I was left handed person and I was buying this. You know, yeah, hey, there it is. There's the grind. This is a good looking knife. I'm going to buy it. But when I get ready to use it as a left handed person, it's not as effective if me as a right handed person now, we'll say we'll call this side B without the, the grind. That doesn't look as attractive, we'll say, as far as when you're getting ready to buy a knife. But when I get ready to use it, guess what? It works better for me as a right handed person than as a left-handed person. But this is few and far between. You don't find a whole lot of chisel ground knives that the grind is on the right-hand side of the blade. Most of them are on the left-hand side of the blade. Set that aside. Got a uh, SOG multi-tool. This one's never been used. Um, but let's look at the, uh, the knife blade on the SOG. Now what we got? We've got grind on the left hand side of the blade. Flip it over. Hey, it's a chisel ground on the right hand side of the blade. So I'm a right handed person. Now of course the finer the blade is, the easier it's going to be able to cut even with the grind being on the, the um, B side instead of the A side. So I can take this and I can cut, but here's the thing. I've got the steel go deeper because the grind is on the other side as a right-handed person. Now, left-handed person picks this knife up, and again, this is the typical way you're going to find most chisel grinds. You're going to find the grind on the left-hand side of the blade. I'm a left-handed person. Pretty much right away, I can bite into the wood. You know, right-handed I've got to, I don't know if you can really see that angle, but I'm really having to come up angle-wide. Now, I, I don't recommend doing this towards me because I don't want to cut myself, but you can see how less of an angle. Now, let's go the other way. And now, I had to come up angle-wise a lot, all right? Not as much, a lot, just to bite into the wood. So it's a less effective cutting for a right-handed person using a, a chisel ground knife when the grind is on the left-hand side of the blade and not the right hand. Right-handed people, the chisel grind needs to be on the right-handed side of the blade. Now, me, I'm gonna, if I'm looking at this blade and I'm going to bite, hey, there's the grind. Hey, that looks good. I like that. Which really don't. It's not ground that well. I mean, it's a... Uh, I would redo this myself. I'd actually put a double. I'd, I'd regrind it um, and put a um, grind on both sides. But just picking it up in the store, looking at it, there's a grind that looks good. Left-handed person looks at it. You don't really see the grind. It's not that exciting. He has to flip it over, and hey, there's the grind. So that's what I'm saying. They're selling these towards 90% of the population. This is the side I hold the knife on. This is the side of the grind zone. That's the side that looks good. But it doesn't cut as well as it would for a left-handed person. The grind is on the wrong side for right-handed people. Now, I'm going to show this knife. It's, it's got serrations on it. I don't like serrations. You can see how much wear this knife's got. Not a whole lot. But if you look at the serrations... This is the left-hand side of the knife. It's serrated. Now, if this wasn't serrated, if this was just ground this way, it would be, technically, it would be a taunt, I mean, a um, chisel grind. Technically, it's a chisel grind with serrations, if you want to look at it that way. But the grind's on this side. 
you flip it over, you, now you can see the serrations, so it still works because what serrations do, they basically saw. So, but still, if you think about it, it's, it is a chisel grind with serrations. Now, right-handed person, I'm cutting this way. Now, let's go up until we bite. There, a, a bit. Now, like I say, with serrations, it's still going to cut because it's going to saw the material. But now, let's look at if I'm left-handed and I'm cutting, I barely have to pick the knife up before I bite. Here, I've got to go a fairly high angle to bite into the wood. If I'm cutting down, that's more force, more pressure, and I'm not slicing as well. Here, I'm not having to go up as high, and I can bite into the wood. This is made, even this is... Uh, serrations is made for a left-handed person because the primary biting edge wants to go to the left not to the right. I can cut with this to the right because it's got serrations on it but I still have to come up higher. It's not as effective. It's on the wrong side. It's well for 10% of the population this is correct left-handed. For 90% of the population it's incorrect because it's made for left-handed people. So really, you either have to not really worry about that if you like um, chisel grinds and bite deep into the wood, which, like I say, doesn't really work as well. Or if you're left-handed, it's great. You can, like I say, find a few knives that the grind is correct for a right-handed person. Now, like I say, this is not an EDC knife. Like I say, this is kind of a backup knife that, like I say, I use for running. But... Just down and dirty, that's a chisel. That's how a chisel works. You know, it still will cut this way, but I've got to come up high to bite the wood, not as it's supposed to be. So if you think of this as a chisel ground knife, the chisel side needs to be on the side that you're cutting on. So if you're right-handed, you tend to cut to the right. If you're left-handed, you tend to cut to the left. All right, thank you.